All right, you guys, I'm going to be showing you how to uh, 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 reset a next book. Uh, this is the next next book, uh, model NX008HD8G. Okay, I'll be showing you how to reset this today. Uh, my daughter locked her password, and so we're just going to reset it today. It's fairly simple. Um, this notebook is pretty good for kids. It's... Uh, one thing I don't like about it is it gets really hot, way too hot, and uh, when you're charging it, it doesn't actually shut off. It uh, stays in like some kind of sleep mode but as it charges, but it gets really hot, so you got to be careful with that. But I really do like this charger. It's one of the small chargers. With my chargers, like when you get a charger like this, always hold on to them because sometimes you get like a product, like you have uh, her, um, <clears throat> it's an alarm, and it uh, displays on the wall. It only came with batteries, and it's really powerful, and it's a real good one. But it uh, you, it only came with uh, uh, for the batteries, but it does have an outlet for the power. You have to buy it yourself, but this works for it. So, like with chargers and stuff, I keep all my chargers because you never know. I think this is a five millimeter, uh, five volt, two amp thing, but this is a little five millimeter, a little teeny one. Those are good to have. Okay, so let me show you how to do this. It only takes a couple of seconds. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, uh, volume up. It's right here. Volume up. Hold the volume up. Then the power button. All right. And let it sit for like five, six, seven seconds. And I think when this green light, this screen turns off then okay there it is so there's the menu on I don't know if you can see that let me see if I can scroll into this or not scroll into it but uh pan into it here for you and set it down so what it says is, well, actually, I'm not. I'll just read it to you what it says. Anyway, so all you're gonna do is it's gonna say it says reboot system now, apply update, apply update from ex, apply update from cache or wipe delete factory reset so if, if it's locked in this is just rebooting it but if it's locked you're gonna have to reset it um, so wipe data factory reset so all you would do is you'd scroll down like so and then you would hit delete factory reset and then you would just hit the power button and I can do it for you boom like that then it's gonna have these it's gonna no 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 no. Then it says yes, delete all user data. So then you scroll down to delete all yes user data, which is that one with the long stuff right there. And then hit that, and there. Now it's rebooting it. I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of glary off the light. Okay, now it says reboot system now, which is the top one. And then just hit your power button again and reboot now it's rebooting so that's about it and now it's rebooting um, fairly easy um, nice thing I really do like about it it did come with this it's good to keep these in my opinion the uh, power supplies because you never know especially when you get one like this something like this because these are generally hard to find unless it comes with it um, you can get them on eBay and uh, Amazon, but of course you got to pay for it. So I just hold on to my power supplies. They're always good to have. But that's it for the next book and for the little review, but quick and easy way to uh, reset it. Not a big deal. All right, you guys, uh, subscribe if you like and uh, like this video if you like it. So you guys have a great day and uh, until next time, huh? Thank you.